For 11 months now, leaders have been scrambling to revive the 2015 nuclear deal. But after Vladimir Putin decided to invade Ukraine, talks in Vienna are under threat. The conflict in Eastern Europe is destined to have a ripple effect on other global issues. But the nuclear talks have specially come under lens because Russia and the United States are major players in this dialogue. And the ongoing standoff between the two nations over Ukraine is complicating diplomacy for Iran. What is clear is that the negotiations in Vienna are being pursued in their own path. Iran's peaceful nuclear cooperation clearly should not be limited or affected by any sanction, including Iran's peaceful nuclear cooperation with Russia and China or other countries. And we understand these claims in this framework. Russia's approach has been a constructive one in reaching a collective agreement in Vienna up to this day, and we understand this in this framework. It's not just Tehran that is requesting this. Moscow has also asked the United States for a written guarantee that sanctions against Russia will not hurt, it, hurt its trade with Iran. The Vienna talks, they're at a crucial stage. On one hand, Tehran is set to respond to UN nuclear watchdog's queries. These questions are related to the uranium traces found in some undeclared nuclear sites in Iran. And on the other hand, then we have Washington that is mulling over accepting points by Tehran. In case the war in Ukraine becomes a stumbling block for the nuclear deal, it will be bad news for Iran. The country has been living under crippling sanctions due to its violation of the deal. Tehran refused to comply with the clauses after former U.S. President Donald Trump abruptly exited the deal in 2019. Pardon me, 2018. But with a slumping economy, Iran could not continue without meeting the West midway. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.